Um, so I'll call the meeting order and thank you recording now. Okay. Um, first or on the agenda is review and approval of the minutes from December 16th. You yeah, all have copies, I hope. I just printed out the no, copy. I mean, I copies. I, I made some. Okay, yeah, there's um, my email. Yeah, I mean, there's uh, there's one. Yeah, I looked at them. I didn't bring them. Um, there's one on the back, on the bottom of page seven, um, the big paragraph. There's a number of mentions of the board. Um, in some cases referring to the planning board, in some cases ah, referring to the CBA. I didn't even notice it. Um, it's confusing. I, so it's confusing. I, I would suggest that yeah. I put in parentheses or something ZBA where it's obviously the ZBA and yeah. planning, where it's obviously yeah. planning. I don't think there's any place that it's um, um, unclear based on the sentence whether it's planning or ZBA. It's, but we, we should we be still, we, yeah, we another another one. So I count about eight places to add ZBA, two places to add planning. Okay. Um, if we're all okay with that. Uh, that's the only change I've been through today. I, I, didn't, I didn't have anything. Okay. Then motion to the minutes. So moved. So moved. Moved. And second. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? They're approved. Okay. Um, next on the agenda item, is, since it's the first meeting of the year, um, we have to elect officers. Um, I'm not understanding Larry's statements earlier this week. I'm willing to well, we'll serve again. again. You just won't be reappointed. Mm -hmm. yeah, maybe. Um, but I also don't feel any great desire if, I, if others want to <laughs> step up. So this is may all be more a volunteer thing than anything else. I think right now the chair, I'm the chairman and, and uh, Dave uh, yeah, Sesky is the vice chairman. Um, um, so I entertain yeah, nominations. I nominate Frank for chairman. Second. Okay. I'll nominate uh, Dave for vice chairman. Second. 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 Okay. Any other nominations? Is there any other positions? Uh, <laughs> we can add a clerk and, or a secretary. <laughs> I was just going to say, I didn't know of any others. We, uh, we don't have a treasurer. No. Um, so I'll suggest we close the nominations. Any? Uh, all in favor of Frank Manish being chairman again? Uh, yeah. Raise your hand. Yeah, I thought we did. Uh, okay, four to zero. All in favor of Dave Metusky being vice chairman? Aye. Okay, four to zero. It takes care of that. Um, so the last piece of business is the um, additional decisions we have to make on the Caldwell case. Um, of course, it was remanded back to us. Um, I think, um, and you've seen some of the email from Peter uh, with the covering, covering letter with the uh, judge's decision. Um, and it, based on our, uh, it all comes down to what one thinks uh, in harmony with the zoning ordinance, with the spirit and intent of the zoning ordinance means. But um, I th think in the minutes we should have that we're talking here about the handicapped access, not yes, not the porch. The porch, the judge supported our yes. decision, right? right? Let's be clear. Actually, let's be clear what we're doing. The the um, the court found in the ZBA's favor in our denial of a variance for the porch. Uh, the judge, the court overturned um, one, prong, one prong of the five uh, prongs of the uh, in lieu of hardship finding mm -hmm. for, um, for access by individuals with disabilities um, and remanded it back to us to decide one, um, if the porch is in the uh, paraphrasing now, but in the uh, in the I'm sorry, the proposed ramp 
uh, is uh, in harmony with the general intent and purpose of the zoning ordinance. And then if we find in favor of that, um, we also then have to decide whether or not uh, the ramp survives the, um, uh, her no longer us regularly using the ordinance. Before we get there, don't we have to decide on whether or not to appeal this? Uh, I don't think you have to decide whether to appeal it. Uh, I mean, I guess to appeal uh, it, you're not going to appeal it. Is there anybody who would think we should? Well, I'm, I'm just going by what <coughs> Peter advised us. Is that what he said um, in his email that we should vote on whether to appeal it or not? <coughs> I think as I don't think if, that's what if I'm said. paraphrasing his, his instructions, we, we were first to decide if we wanted to appeal. He made a recommendation on that, but we first had to decide. You, you mean decided, appeal if we, if we uh, decide not to grant the handicap? No, 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 no. If we were going to <coughs> appeal the decision, the judge's of course, refusal to reconsider. It. No, not even that. Um, to appeal the decision of the court to the New Hampshire Supreme Court and. Um, and if we decided not to appeal, then we should schedule a rehearing to um, accept, to review the remand and review. On the ramp. Yeah, on, I, on the various requests. On the ramp. On the ramp. On the ramp. Yeah. Yeah, the, what, the other one he's already said, what he says is that in the unlikely event that a majority of the board wants to pursue an appeal to the New Hampshire Supreme Court, then I would suggest that Frank, as chairman, make a formal request to the selectmen to fund the legal fees for the appeal. So does someone want to make a motion that we appeal? Well, I, I think we have to decide that. No, no, it's very simple. In the unlikely event, that's what the man says. He doesn't say you've got to have a vote. Okay. So if you want to make a motion that we appeal, then if you get a second, then we can vote on it. Well, I don't wish to appeal. <laughs> well, then let's let it go. Yeah. I don't think anybody... Uh, does, does anybody want to move that we appeal this to the I, I guess Supreme Court? It, at Supreme least, Court. I need some, some understanding here. At least, we obviously don't need to appeal the porch. We're already supporting no, no, the no, porch. No, that's no, 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 talking no. about. Okay. The court, the court found in our favor with regard to the porch right. and our denial of that variance. Um, the decision of the court of the Superior Court now with the, now that the motions for reconsideration have been considered is also final yeah. and it's been remanded back to us. At this point we could you know appeal the Superior Court's decision to the Supreme Court regarding uh, the only issue left really is the is the ramp. Yes. Okay. I just wanted to make sure that was yes. That my way of thinking yes. was correct. Um, so so if, and the two can be separated, and so we say, yeah, okay, the porch is out of line, but the ramp. Yeah, yeah. Well, goes. if we were to appeal his decision, his decision was, as I read it, yes, they didn't have an unnecessary hardship. I don't agree with their position. So that means that the porch was a dead issue. He said, but that's not the end of the analysis. You've got to go on the handicap. So if we were to appeal, we would be appealing his decision to remand it to us because he said, as okay. Chris had said when he was here, you don't have to, you know, all he has yeah. to do is show that that's a reasonable thing right. for somebody to do. Right. right. You know, okay. so the judge agreed with Chris basically. Okay. Okay. So. And Peter Malley still doesn't agree with Chris. Yeah. But I don't think we're going to go to the Supreme no, Court. No, we're not. And Goodbye. honestly, if we did, I'm sure Chris would probably find some other things to talk about too. <laughs> well, we can't because all you can talk about is well, because, well, but there's some probably some things he doesn't agree with in the case too. Um, so then, then we agree as a board not to appeal the, the decision. Oh, well, nobody's even made a motion to appeal. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so I, yeah, I, I guess no the motion. That, that's good done. So we agree as a board not to appeal? Well, we nobody made a motion. I'll make a motion that we appeal the case. Is there a second? There is no second. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I guess that's one way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, so now, uh, now we're, as I, as I, let me,
try. We're now dealing only with the um, with the ramp uh, for disabled access. Um, uh, we're talking. In fact, we're talking about specifically about the ramp that is depicted in the plan that uh, the uh, the applicant gave us back in April, um, and we have to make the decision. Uh, we have to make a decision whether or not this is. Um, uh, in harmony with the general intent and spirit, I think, of the ordinance. Um, and then, if we agree to that, then make a decision on whether or not the ramp survives. Now, so we have to go through that. We also, I think, have an opportunity if, um, if Chris is amenable. Uh, to take notice that the planning board has formally offered a amendment to the zoning ordinance that I think would effectively move the setback here, measured the same way from 50 feet to something like 25 plus or minus feet. I'm not sure exactly because I'm not sure exactly how large the right way is. Um, of course, if that passes, I think that pretty much moots this. Right. So we, you know, if, um, if the applicant is willing, we could simply decide to defer this till after town meeting and then take it up again after town meeting. I, if it's, I, if it's, I don't think we really need to do that. Okay. We, had, we had one vote um, on the substantial justice yes. issue, which said they didn't think that was a big deal. I don't remember. I, I'm, I'm not. I'm just. I'm not recommending this. Yeah. I just want to make sure it's an option. We have that option. No. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I, is anybody I, interested in pursuing that option? No, I'm not. Okay. I am. I am. It, for, first of all, <clears throat> I want to make sure that we're on good ground that um, tonight qualifies as a properly noticed meeting to discuss this part of it. Did everybody? Does Chris agree? Okay. Um, then I guess the question that I would ask, as Peter recommends, that we have essentially already decided that it was in harmony and that the only thing that's left for us to decide is whether the, the deck would, or the um, ramp, would, um, I believe the name party was Virginia Caldwell, uh, that yeah. when Virginia Caldwell had no longer had need of the ramp, that the ramp, um, the variance then would be null and void. Um, I, I think with the harmony issue, the question that I would ask, is there a way, according to the judge ruling, that we can find that the ramp is legal? Legal meaning? That the ramp, is there a way? Meets the requirements of the state as far as slope no, and no, all that, that stuff? The, that, the, that, the, that the request for the variance based on the reasonable um, or um, uh, need for the, I can't think of the wording exactly now, right now, of the ordinance, but the, um, the, the deck exists for the, or the ramp exists for the, um, uh, Handicapped access. for the use of the disability. Right. And that um, the court has given us a way, and my, as my understanding of it is, to accept that that is legal. In other words, that the variance would be granted. Right. Well, and I would accept it. The court, I, I don't the think court hasn't given us a way to accept that that's legal. The I, court has told us, you've got to go back, you've got to look at this, and there are a couple of things you have to decide. If we decide, then somebody could say, selectman could say, no, no, we're going to challenge that. Or a butter could say, we're going to challenge that. But the court well, didn't give us a way to say the, it's the, legal. The, he said, you've got to decide. The selectman and the building inspector are already, already on record as saying they have no objection to the ramp. Yeah. I guess I'm not aware of that record. Well, but it doesn't matter. Well, I, I, I think it's well, not, you know, it's not an issue. And you say you're on record, but I didn't see the record. Okay. Okay. And, and, I, I, and I have found that I've got to be very careful when you say something to see the record. That's really? Yes, I have. Wonderful. Can we, um, I don't think the question for us is really deciding 
It's, I, I mean, I guess I'm not sure what you mean by legal. I think it's, to me, it's fairly clear. We have to decide whether or not um, this is in harmony with the general purpose and intent of the zoning ordinance. Um, well, yeah, and, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I do, or uh, yeah, Mr. Great. I think that answers this question. If you decide that it's in harmony with the spirit, the general yeah. purpose and yeah. intent of the zoning ordinance, it's legal. That makes if it legal. If you decide it's not in harmony right. with the general and purpose and intent of the zoning ordinance, it's not legal. Thank you. So, yeah, well, that's okay. and so that's why I didn't understand throwing the legal thing in it. It's just a question of is it in the harmony? Yeah. That's so, all. And yeah, we've already on record, um, of course, that. Uh, we've made a decision on the spirit of the ordinance in the first call. Yeah. Um, so it would seem, you know, though I'm not, it would seem that harmony of purpose and intent and spirit of the ordinance are much the same. Um, yeah. So I would um, think that I, I don't see any other way other than to to uh, uh, propose that we find that. Well, I, yeah, I agree. Just. A quick question. At this point, should we consider amendments? For example, when the house is sold and transferred to another owner, should the ramp I think that's the, stay that's the last part. That's, that's the second last part. part. Yeah. First, we decide whether or not it, it to... Is. Okay. Uh, uh, I mean, what's going to happen is we will probably say that this is in harmony with the general purpose and yep. zone ordinance. That, that effectively means we granted the variance. Yeah. But we have one other step. Yeah, we have to decide whether or not, not the ramp can survive when she when she stops regularly using the premises. Yeah. I think is the phrase. Okay. Um, and you know, we'll have to talk about what that means and yeah. what how as a board we feel. But first, let's get to the, yeah. taking a position on yeah. the harmony issue. Um, would anybody like to make a motion? I move that we uh, accept that it's in harmony with the, with the ordinance, the with the harmony ordinance. and spirits. Yeah. Second. 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 All in favor. Aye. Okay. Um, See, I'm still so learning. So the last question, and you know, again, we were, as I said, I think we're referring to the specific ramp configuration that was right. given to us in April. Right. right. And um, for point, point of order, you you were talking about. The court saying that, or finding against the porch or denying the porch. Uh, I don't agree with that. I, but for for argument purposes, that the ramp is a covered ramp. Yes, I mean, right. as, as configured. So right. I, I don't yeah, as they to, configured when they gave us the ramp plans. Right. They have to <coughs> the roof. Obviously, they have to make some changes. Clear. Yeah. Uh, we have plans. I think. We were proving the variance for those April or whatever plans, which will involve some changes to what's currently there. And in, in, the, in, in the ramp, ramp will, un understood, but yeah. it's not removing. No, no. And the ramp would have to meet Roof. the code. Right. Yeah. And and we have to name said person. Right. Yes. yes. Yeah. But we already have. Yes, Virginia. We we've, we've made the finding that. She has a disability and that she regularly uses premises. At Virginia Gold. Yes. Yes. Um, Question, so, did we ever, did anybody, I'm just curious for future cases, does anybody have to show other than saying, yeah, she she we, needs this access? We, I mean, we didn't ask them to do that. I mean, I'm just well, we curious. Did. They, 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 we they, did, they, if you recall, we brought in the, we brought in the, the, per, the her handicap permit, Oh, did you? Yeah. Oh, okay, so we got, yeah. And we voted that we recognized that it was so, a need. Yeah, okay. But I just wanted to make sure we were clear on the naming of the person was Virginia Cole. Yeah, okay. Um, so, I, I'm not quite sure how to approach whether or not the ramp has to be removed after okay. it, um, after she no longer is using the premises. I, I, don't, I, I would not vote for that. Uh, you know, you put the ramp on, you know, it's a five foot, and yeah. it probably won't be a five foot if the, if the yeah. you know, ordinance changes. So, I mean, it's not a big deal. I'd, I'd be more inclined to, in the future, in some other case, if the ramp protruded more or was more, um, more of an issue in the neighborhood. More intrusive. Yeah, this one, in this case, it's not. 
Um, it's fairly straightforward, I think. Is there anybody who thinks the rack should be removed? No, I do not. No, I don't. It doesn't matter. To me. Okay, then I'd entertain a motion uh, to find that. Um, let me make sure what we're doing here. Um, whether or not to require that uh, the variance shall survive um, only so long as the particular person uh, has a continued need to use the premises. I mean, so that, I, that's, that, I did that in a negative, so um, make your motion so that we are not required to be torn down, I guess. <laughs> I would make a motion that um, we do not, that the ZBA does not require that the deck would be removed. Or the ramp. The ramp would not be removed um, when Virginia Caldwell no longer requires it. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Well, there's nobody else here. Yeah, I was just going to say. Okay. Um, so I will write up that decision and publish it. Publish it. And um, I think that finishes our business yeah. at this point. Good. Thank, thank you all for your considerable time. And oh, well, you thank you. It was. Um, it was an interesting. You were an extraordinary advocate for your client, and came up with a lot for us to consider. Thank you. Thank you. Um, anybody in favor of amending of uh, adjourning? So moved. <laughs>